dad's back and he's making Filipino cuisine easy to make using the Instant Pot once again. One of my wife's favorite Filipino foods is a soup called beef bulalo. It's from the Southern Luzon region of the Philippines. And it's this wonderfully complex, but simple to make soup made out of beef shanks. You take the beef shanks and you simmer them for over five hours until they break down and all the bone marrow and the collagen and the little bit of fat that is in them breaks down and it forms this wonderful broth and it's absolutely delicious. Problem is, once again, it takes five hours. Not too much to this one, everybody. It's just chop up some vegetables and throw everything in the Instant Pot. Pretty simple. Here's the dad hack. Use an old vegetable scrubber to get the little hairs off of corn. You just take the corn, hold it here, and give it a nice little rub. Go in different directions. And it gets a good majority of it. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good. You're gonna chop it into about one inch little, I don't know, rounds. I take my knife, put it where I want it, give it a little push. One whole white onion. You're gonna do just quarters. Big chunks is good. Onions. One whole cabbage. We only need half of it. Set it aside. We'll use it for something another day. Same thing, quarters. I like to rinse mine after I've cut it. Cabbage. Beef shanks. Stew meat. The really traditional recipe calls for kneecap. Good luck finding that. Onions. Tablespoon of black peppercorn. Whole. Started with a tablespoon of salt. We're gonna adjust after the first cook and see how it tastes. But this should add a little bit of Salt to everything. And now, good old H2O. We're gonna fill this so that it covers everything. And goes just shy of the max line. That's it. We're gonna put the lid back on this thing and we're gonna cook it for 30 minutes. Don't forget, make sure you have the right ring in your Instant Pot, your all-purpose ring. If you don't know what I'm talking about, check out my top five tips and hacks video for the Instant Pot. I just love that music. And then make sure we're set to ceiling. 
select the manual setting and 30 minutes. The first part of the cooking is done. So we're gonna release the pressure. Meat's falling apart. Looks pretty good. Give it a little taste. Pretty well seasoned. Doesn't need a whole lot more salt. I don't think I'm gonna add any. Time to add in the corn. Select the manual setting and 10 minutes. The final step, open up your Instant Pot. And add in some cabbage. It's a tight fit, but the cabbage is gonna cook down. Leave the lid on, select the saute, and hit the adjust button to more. And that's it. Total cook time was about two hours, and this stuff's fantastic. Check back, because I plan on doing a lot more Filipino recipes hacked with the Instant Pot. Maybe I'll even do some sous vide ones. For more recipes and videos, visit dadgotthis.com. To be sure you don't miss anything, be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the damn bell. I double dog dare you. Come on, you have to do it. It was a double dog dare. I mean, those are the rules.